As the world stands on the brink of a new era defined by rapid technological progress and shifting global power dynamics, the stakes for national and economic security have never been higher. At the heart of this transformation is the battle for supremacy in manufacturing and critical technologies, a battle in which China has emerged as a formidable leader, dramatically outpacing Western nations such as the United Kingdom. This comprehensive exploration delves into China's ascension as the world's manufacturing titan, with an estimated $5.03 trillion in output for 2024 and its pioneering advances across various high-tech fields. From dominating the global production of photovoltaic technology and electric batteries to spearheading innovations in AI, robotics, and quantum computing, China's strategy intertwines technological advancement with strategic national priorities. Meanwhile, the UK's efforts to keep pace highlight a critical junction for Western economies in the face of Asia's rapid rise. Further, China's prowess in scientific research, where it now leads in both the quantity and impact of scholarly publications worldwide, surpassing longtime leaders like the United States and the UK. Despite China's established dominance in high-tech sectors and science and technology, the UK has implemented stringent export controls aimed at curbing the transfer of critical technologies to China. This raises an intriguing question. Should the focus of technology control be on preventing China's access to Western tech, or rather on managing what the West imports from China? In this video, we'll delve into the technological standings of both nations. We'll explore evidence suggesting that China may not rely on Western technology as much as the West relies on Chinese innovations in various fields. This analysis will help us understand the dynamics of technological dependence and control in the global arena. In this video, we present a detailed comparison of China's performance in manufacturing, high-tech industries, and research innovation relative to the UK. Before we proceed, we encourage you to consider liking the video to show your support for our channel. Additionally, we invite you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Your feedback is invaluable and will help us reach a wider audience. Thank you for your support. China continues to lead the world in manufacturing output significantly outpacing other nations including the UK. As of 2024, China's manufacturing sector is projected to produce an estimated $5.03 trillion in value added, a figure that underscores its status as the top manufacturing nation globally. This accounts for approximately 27% of China's total national output, which is indicative of the central role manufacturing plays in its economy. In contrast, the UK, while still among the top manufacturing countries, has a significantly smaller scale in this sector. The latest data places the UK's manufacturing output at around $244 billion, which represents about 10% of its national output. This places the UK far behind China, not only in terms of total output, but also as a percentage of national economic activity. China's manufacturing industry has seen robust growth, with an increase in industrial production by 6.8% year-on-year as of December 2023, reflecting strong activities across various manufacturing sectors. This growth is part of a broader trend where China has maintained a dominant position in global manufacturing, contributing 20% to the global manufacturing output. The UK and other Western economies face challenges in matching the scale and growth of China's manufacturing capabilities emphasizing the need for strategic planning and investment to enhance their competitive stance in the global manufacturing landscape. China leads the world in 37 out of 44 critical technologies. China has made significant strides in critical technologies, which are essential for both civilian and military applications, and its achievements span various innovative fields. China has been aggressively investing in AI, aiming to become a world leader by 2030. It has fostered a conducive ecosystem for the development of AI technologies, from facial recognition systems to AI-driven healthcare solutions. The country's robotics industry is also booming, supported by heavy government investment and initiatives like Made in China 2025, which aims to upgrade China's manufacturing base by developing high-tech industries including robotics. In comparison, the UK recognizes AI and robotics as strategic areas, and is pushing to advance these fields through its International Technology Strategy, which aims to build strategic advantage and ensure development aligns with UK values. However, compared to China's massive scale of deployment and integration of AI across various sectors, the UK's focus is more on ethical governance and international collaboration. China is also leading in quantum communication and computing technologies. 
This includes the development of the world's first quantum satellite, Mikeus, which enables ultra-secure communications that are impossible to intercept. In quantum computing, China's efforts are visible in their development of quantum processors and the establishment of a $10 billion National Quantum Information Science Laboratory in Hefei. The UK has committed significantly to quantum technologies with investments aimed at making it a global center of excellence. While China has made notable advances, particularly with the deployment of the Mikia satellite for quantum communication, the UK is still behind. In the energy sector, China is a global leader in the production and implementation of photovoltaic solar technology, manufacturing about 70% of the world's solar cells. Furthermore, China is pushing the boundaries in electric battery technology, vital for electric vehicles which are central to China's strategy to reduce carbon emissions and dominate the global auto industry. Chin is also a global leader in advanced materials. This area covers a range of materials crucial for various high-tech applications, from semiconductors to aerospace and beyond. China's development of advanced materials such as graphene and rare earth elements processing technology is strategic for its technological independence and global competitiveness. The UK is also focusing on advanced materials, essential for next-generation technology applications. The integration of AI and machine learning in material science is seen as a key strategy to enhance the manufacturing processes and development of new materials, which could help bridge some gaps compared to China's extensive production and application of advanced materials like graphene and rare earth elements. China has solidified its position as a leader in scientific research output and high-impact studies, notably surpassing both the United States and the UK. This achievement encompasses a broad spectrum of technologies and fields, underpinned by substantial infrastructure developments and strategic global positioning in research. China now leads globally in the total number of scientific papers published annually, with a significant portion of these studies recognized as high-impact work. In recent evaluations, China accounted for 23.4% of global scientific paper output and an impressive 27.2% of the world's top 1% most cited research papers. This positions China ahead of the U.S. in both total output and high-impact research, with the U.K. considerably behind in these metrics. In terms of the Nature Index, which assesses research output in natural sciences, China's research institutions have shown substantial growth, contributing decisively to the country's top position globally. While the U.S. still shows strong performance, particularly in health sciences, China's ascent in the natural sciences is significant. This shift underscores China's broad-based commitment to becoming a science superpower, with consistent increases in high-quality research output across various scientific disciplines. China's research strategy involves not only enhancing quantity, but also boosting the quality of its scientific studies. Efforts to attract top international talent and substantial government investment in research and development have been key to its success. These efforts are part of broader initiatives to foster innovation and self-reliance in science and technology. That's all for this video. We hope this analysis has shed some light on the complex interplay of technology transfer between the West and China. If you found this discussion insightful, please consider subscribing to our channel and hitting the like button. Your support helps us bring more content like this to you. We also invite you to join the conversation in the comments below, share your thoughts and any questions you might have. What's your take on the technological dependencies on the West and China? Let's discuss. Your interaction enriches our community and drives deeper exploration into these critical topics.